Kia ora YouTubers, my name is Dan and this video here is one of the free ones that I give away as part of my larger course. So if you are keen and you do enjoy it, uh, check out, there'll be a link in the description. Uh, but for now, let's uh, go off and look at the free stuff. Hi, my name is Dan. In this video, we're gonna add all the extra rows and columns to the other bands. So I'm gonna click inside my services band and I'm gonna click grid and row. I'm gonna nest it inside here. And this one, if you look at the um, template, it has, I'm gonna turn the guides off, one, two, three, four. Okay, you can also see there's, there's bits of text underneath. We're gonna leave that a little bit later on because we're gonna look at something called nesting. Um, well, nesting inside nesting, um, but we'll do that later on. So at the moment, let's just do a nest of four columns. Okay, and there's one, two, three, four, perfect. I'm gonna come down here. Now make sure when you click inside, remember it's a large three, 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 which makes 12. Inside this one, let's check out our Photoshop document. It's gonna be the same. It's gonna have four columns. So I'm gonna just make sure, click inside portfolio, insert grid row and column, and I nest it inside of it and it's gonna be four. Click enter. And we do the same thing. We'll deal with uh, all the text and images inside of it a little bit later on when we deal with images. And last bit is the footer. So I'm gonna click on the footer and I'm gonna go row and this one here is let's have a look it's actually just one row and one column so i'm going to nest it inside and it's just going to be one column and just to double check click inside you can see it is a column of 12 and it is one row awesome now well, let's put the text inside our footer it's on our uh, text here if i select him now if i click inside and i go to insert paragraph and i can nest it inside select the text and i paste it now file, save all, and that is all the rows and columns we're gonna need for this particular site. All right, now let's move on to the next video. Hey there, remember this video is a free extract from my course of more than 60 videos. So if you're serious about learning Dreamweaver, check out the link down below. If you like this free thing, give it a like, give it a share, I'd be really appreciative. Thanks, hi da da.